welcome to the channel. My name is Kenya. Stay connected. Get me recommended. Tell your friends about me. Find bonus information. Leave me feedback. And now for this awesome video coming up right now. Habari Gani. Habari Gani. Umoja. Umoja. Today is December 26th. It is the first day of Kwanzaa. The first principle of Kwanzaa is Umoja, which means unity. To strive for and to maintain unity in the family, community, nation, and race. One of my goals for the year 2021 is to become a part of an organization in which I can feel a sense of unity. I'll keep you updated on that goal in a future video. This is a symbol of Kwanzaa. It is Mazao or the crops. It's symbolic of African harvest celebrations and the rewards of productive and collective labor. Psalms 128 quotes, you will enjoy the fruit of your labor. How joyful and prosperous you will be. Ecclesiastes chapter 5 verses 18 through 20 says, Even so, I have noticed one thing at least that is good. It is good for people to eat, drink, and enjoy their work under the sun during the short life God has given them and to accept their lot in life. And it is a good thing to receive wealth from God and the good health to enjoy it. I love how inspiring Bible verses can be, but I always recommend for people to read the entire passage surrounding any particular Bible verse to get the full context. As such, I've provided links in the description box where you can listen to full passages of these Bible verses. You know, some of the best feelings I've had in my entrepreneurship journey have been from the times that I got sales on my eBay store. Seeing those dollar signs amount go up made me feel like I was accomplished. The up and down, mostly down emotions that I felt working on some of my other business plans was because I was putting in so much effort and hard work into my goals, but not seeing the results. That is not a principle of Mazao. I'm not against persistence, but I have personally felt better those times when I was able to let go of certain ventures that I felt were not profitable or not fruitful. One of the challenges of being an entrepreneur is knowing when to keep going and when to let something go. So tell me, what are the most recent fruits of your labor that you have harvested after putting in hard work? I look forward to reading about that in the comments section. Thank you for watching today's Kwanzaa video on Umoja, Unity. Let me know what gives you a sense of unity. I look forward to reading that in the comment section and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.